Francois from Masterbox Limited, coming up next on Monster Hobbies Model Car Garage. Hello everybody and welcome back to another great model car unboxing video where today we're actually not looking at a model car, we're actually looking at an accessory for your model cars. This is a Francois, may I introduce you to her. She is from Masterbox Limited and she is a 124 scale figure that is really like a 1940s type of female figure which you can display with your vintage model car kits. So. Without further ado, let us check her out today as we unbox this amazing model kit. Now we step all the way back into the 1940s with a Francois, a nice 124 scale model kit by Masterbox. She of course is a figure that will look good in your car collection with your 1930s, 1940s car. In fact, pictured in the back here by illustrator V. Peatlin is a 1936 Packard. You can tell by the hubcaps on here, as well as the details on the car. And our sculptor is A. Gagarin. So, a very cool model kit. I do have one of these available at Monster Hobbies right now. You can check out all the other Masterbox figures I have online. www.monster-hobbies.ca, of course. And for such a big box, actually, there is not much to this. <laughs> this is part of the Dangerous Curves series. Actually, there's the the QR code. I don't know, can you actually take a picture of that and then uh, check it out? If so, like right on this video, if you can actually do that, let me know in the comment section if it worked. We get one big long parts tree, which we'll look at in a minute. And then once you glue your figure all together, this is how she will look. And here you've got all your Vallejo colors. They also give you the numbers for Life Color, Mr. Color, and Tamiya. Uh, there are one, two, three, four, five colors. But what I want to do in a future series is show you how to paint up Francois using Citadel paints from the Games Workshop. We'll make her look as realistic as we can. So now, let's open up the box. And just take a look at the parts tree which of course is in a nice plastic bag. What's kind of nice about this is it is a resealable bag, so there's a sticker on here. And we can just pull this right out. Now unfortunately this is in grey plastic, so it might be a little bit hard to see with my background. But if I take this right up into the camera here as close as I can, you can see the nice sculpting work that was done on this. The uh, legs with the high heel shoes. Now, I'm kind of not too sure if this is actually how someone in the 1940s would dress, because I do know there was some alternate clothing and sort of thing from what we see in the photographs, but I'm not sure if this is supposed to be a 1940s type of, you know, woman, like let's say from 1941, or if this is sort of a 1980s style, 40s style interpretation get back with the glitter and be rich kind of thing, you know, with the high heels and all that. So I'm not fully sure. I haven't really discovered that quite perfectly yet, but it still would look good in a 1940s era diorama, which I am intending to do in the future. Stay tuned on this channel to see progress. Well, you've already seen me scale up the buildings, so anyway, that is our look at our Francois figure and I will be off to get this thing going sometime in the future. Well, I sure hope you enjoyed this great video. It looks like a really cool figure and I'm going to be building her up for, uh, of course, my display. I do have one for sale at the store, which you can check out at www.monster-hobbies.ca. I'll leave the link in the description down below because it's a figure kit, of course. And I have many other great Masterbox figures in this scale also available for sale, as well as some ICM figures, like the 1910 Ford Mechanica Girls. Really cool stuff. And if, or once you're on our website at www.monster-hobbies.ca, don't forget to check out our newsletter, click on it, become one of our members, because you can get some really amazing, great discounts and coupon codes by becoming a Monster Hobbies newsletter person. <laughs> 
anyway, if you love these great videos and want to see more like it, don't forget to like, subscribe, and share this video with all your friends and family. Pound that notification bell so that every time I make a new video, you're the first one to see it. And until next time, everybody, happy model building.